My most controversial project was turning this decorative box into a functioning greenhouse. Here's how I did it while addressing the most common questions. First up, how did I increase the humidity without a humidifier? I used two different types of weather strips. I put this flappy flap kind on the top of the door. It's a simple sticker and when I close the door, you'll see that the gap is covered. Then I used a small foam weather stripping seal to cover the gap where the door hinges. This was probably the biggest gap that I was able to seal. I used the same foam for the bottom piece, leaving gaps for the corners where the greenhouse sits. Now when I stick the greenhouse back on top, you'll see that that gap is completely sealed. Now you don't have to weather strip if you don't plan on putting high humidity need plants in here, but here are some of the things that I put in that thrive in these conditions. Top reason people gave for making this was actually keeping the cats away too. The most common question I got was how I don't get mold if there's no fans inside. You can put in a small fan if you want to, but I haven't needed one because I check on my plants frequently, and also if you're that worried about it, you can just do this. There's your fresh air. Now these aren't just LEDs, these are full spectrum grow lights. Allocations need 400 foot candles to thrive, and my light meter shows it's almost at 500. So that's more than enough usable light that my plant needs. Follow along to see me make a giant version of this.